Ladies and gentlemen and dear students, I welcome each one of you here today to the inaugural ceremony of Usha Venkatesh Foundation. A special welcome to our guest of honor, Dr. T.P. Shashikumar. Mr. Shashikumar is an eminent scientist, teacher, writer, and an educationalist. He has held various important positions through his career. Consultant at Shoba Developers, scientist at ISRO, Deputy Director at Cabinet Secretariat are only a few. It is our honor today to have you here, sir. Brightland Discovery celebrates its Silver Jubilee this year and also the establishment of Usha Venkatesh Foundation. Mrs. Usha Venkatesh has been an amazing mother, a wonderful teacher, and above all, a kind and a compassionate human being. Over the past 25... <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen and dear students, I welcome each one of you here today to the inaugural ceremony of Usha Venkatesh Foundation. A special welcome to our guest of honor, Dr. T.P. Shashikumar. Mr. Shashikumar is an eminent scientist, teacher, writer, and an educationalist. He has held various important positions through his career, consultant at Shoba Developers, scientist at ISRO, deputy director at Cabinet Secretariat are a few to name. It is our honor today to have you here with us, sir. Brightland Discovery celebrates its Silver Jubilee this year and also the establishment of Usha Venkatesh Foundation. Mrs. Usha has been an amazing mother, a wonderful teacher, and above all, a kind and compassionate human being. Over the past 25 years, she's had enormous knowledge and experience in childhood and education. She now wants to focus on giving this knowledge back to the society. Usha Venkatesh Foundation is her dream project through which she wishes to reach out to more and more people. As a part of this establishment, we will launch new initiatives in the coming months. Kindergarten Teachers Training Program is our first initiative and you'll hear about more as and when we roll it out in the coming years. I now welcome Dr. T.P. Shashikumar to speak to you all. Thanks. So we have come to the concluding part. Of course, as organizers, we are very thankful to Dr. T.P. Shashikumar. And we have more opportunities to thank him. But now I would request one of the participants, it can be one or more, either a student or a parent, to come over. And on behalf of all the participants, you can propose a vote of thanks. Let me see. A vote of thanks from one among you. It can be a parent, it can be a teacher also. Uh, I'm sorry, a student. Me, who were once upon a time my students. Let me see. Do we have more? Yes, Arati, another my student. Yes? More children to, for vote of thanks? Advocate. <laughs> Advocate. <laughs> Girls around me, no boys. Boys are thankless. Boys are? Tangless. Tangless. <laughs> yeah. Sir says boys are tongueless. I am so happy he said, he didn't say it is brainless. Now I'm going to count down a last chance for the boys. Where are my Brightlanders? Countdown starts. We have four. Three. No, no, no. We have four. I'm going to give them more time. No, ten. Ten. Nine. Boys, please. Eight. Seven. Boys, I request you. Just like sir said, I'm begging. Six, five, again a girl. This is a girl. <laughs> Six, five, four, three, two, and one. One boy at last. <laughs> yeah, you can. A very good afternoon to all of you. 
I don't know what I should say. First, I'm really happy to be here. Uh, like, uh, I finished my seventh standard and, and I'm coming back here after a long time. Happy to see everybody over here. And um, uh, really, I didn't, I didn't actually have any idea of what, what I should be doing after my 10th. Uh, now, I think I really have a base and I'm free to explore all the opportunities I may get in my life. And actually you have set me free from all my barriers, I feel. That is what I really feel. I can think free more than anybody else. Uh, my parents are not going to compel me. Nobody is going to exert any pressure on me. And I feel free now to take any decision. That is what actually I feel you have done to me within this one hour. And uh, I don't know, I'm really tensed, but at the same time, really happy to see all my friends back here. And uh, most of all, I want, I really personally thank Usha Madam for creating more opportunities, giving us all a chance. Thank you, thank you Usha Madam. And uh, really happy to be here, thank you. First of all, I'd like to thank Pushai Madam for giving us this opportunity to come here once again. I'm very happy to be here, as I can see uh, many of my old friends. And um, sir, um, your talk has been very um, entertaining and we enjoyed a lot. I'm sure um, in our future it will help us to mold our career. And thank you. Good evening, respected Usha Madam, uh, Sri T.P. Shashikumar Sir, uh, parents, teachers, and all my dear friends. Today I stand before you uh, really happy to see my old friends and teachers. Every part of my life, uh, all, through my, uh, all through this journey, uh, in every turning point Usha Ma'am was with me. I still remember after writing the 10th exam, uh, I was kind of a studious, uh, I was a good student all along and uh, after the 10th exam I wrote the exam well and uh, I just went for some entrance exams for admission uh, in plus one. I ke uh, after writing the entrance for SDV, I was really confused. I, I didn't know what I'm going to do next. Uh, the future was not at all defined for me. My parents, my dad wanted me to become an engineer which is a common trend for every student here. Uh, I didn't want, I want, I always wanted to do something different. That is what my Usha Madam taught me. Uh, so I came here, I just wanted her advice, which I, I was confused about the stream I had to choose. I was, uh, I didn't know if I had to choose science or commerce. And finally, uh, I met her in her office. The first thing she asked me was, uh, I told her, Usha Madam, I don't know uh, which stream I should choose. Do you think I could uh, manage science? Then the first thing sh she told me is, Gaudi, science is not your thing. You just think, you, uh, think, of, think about what you're good at. Uh, I could mug up science or anything, but I just thought then. Then she also asked me, uh, are you, I, I used to dance, I was a dancer. She asked me, do you dance anymore? Then I said, no ma'am. Uh, I got busy with tuitions, uh, studies, everything. I never dance. I just, I just lost that talent of mine. That is when I realized uh, we, have, we have got so much talent inside us. And most of the time in the journey of life, you have so much work to do uh, in school, academic wise, you just forget who you are and what, uh, what your real talents are. And after the talk, I went home and told mom, mom, I'm going to take commerce. I've decided uh, I really want to become a lawyer. I think that is, uh, that is where my metal lies. And today, uh, this talk was very much entertaining, uh, very much informative, and I'm very much inspired by, by your words, sir. Uh, through an entertaining talk, you just gave us so much information. Uh, you just inspired me to think really different. Thank you so much for this opportunity. Thank you so much for giving me this wonderful day. Uh, Tusha Madam and T.P. Shashikumar, sir. Thank you so much. Thank you all.
good evening everyone so firstly starting by thanking god almighty for giving me such an opportunity for coming here attending the precious class of a former scientist t shesh kumar and i am greatly thankful to everyone who have given me such an opportunity first i said this word opportunity so we have to really stress in that word opportunity here usha ma'am she count 10 from 10 9 8 7 6 5 4 3 2 1 really 10 times she had given everyone opportunity for coming here but in your future this 10 counts will not be there just one solely someone or some opportunity will come in front of you to express your talent or to express yourself or to express yourself in front of a large crowd so really i um, i don't have the right to say because i had i had already taken nine counts to come here but i have to say that lot of the students here sitting here like to become an engineer or a doctor or an is officer or as she said she have to become a lawyer but we should not decide that in a point that we should go there or we should opt that we should develop it from our lower level that means at least from the 8th standard someone here the many foundation coachings have started to go for iits from 8th standard onwards so that base you should have or that capacity you should have to raise up to that standard it's not that we should go or we should be forced to go in that but we should have passion or we should have something that we should how to go in that and we should develop our career passion deserves our career that means we should not think that that we don't like and we should opt in that but we should have a passion in that to go inside that so i am not um, extending my talk but i should say my profession i like to become a doctor but i have a passion for teaching as well so i think uh, by becoming a doctor i can still continue as a teacher or to um, express like this in front of a large crowd but as a teacher i cannot go and serve a patient for anything you know so that base we should have to develop such a thing or um, at least the class give me such an opportunity to think differently to think in such other way that others think so to think differently or to opt an another way to think and decide our future so thank you thank you all extending a sincere and heartfelt thanks to everyone who have attended this class and also <laughs> sir and madam and uh, i i am also happy that such a foundation class has started and um, hoping that they are, they will continue their um, their like this way coaching classes or their this personality development classes in future also once again thanking thanking all thank you Good evening everyone I am Maria and I am also an ex student of Brightland school uh, Today what I would like to say is that everybody talked about how this class was useful for their careers but what I would like to say is that it was sort of a uh, personality development class for me I it helped me uh, to think about so many things it uh, it Uh, i think this class already changed my personality and thank you sir for this enlightening talk pin enikku oru karyane parayanundi ivide sir edakki vechittu paranjayirunnu edu teacher samsarikkumbodum beg you aanu cheyyune please listen to my class pashe oru karyam parayanundu anna usha madam eppa samsarichalum aarade sradhe idu vare thirinjadayittu enikku arinjuda ivide koodidene കൂടുതൽ കൂടുതൽ സംസാരിക്കാനാണ് ഇവിടെ എല്ലാവരും പറഞ്ഞുകൊണ്ടിരിക്കുന്നത് അപ്പം അത് താങ്ക് യു ഫോർ ദാറ്റ് ടു ഞാനിവിടെ ടെൻ ഇയേഴ്സ് ഓൾമോസ്റ്റ് ടെൻ ഇയേഴ്സ് ഐ സ്റ്റഡീഡ് ഇൻ ദ സ്കൂൾ താങ്ക് യു ഉഷ മാഡം ആൻഡ് താങ്ക് യു സർ ഫോർ സച്ച് എ ലവ്ലി ആൻഡ് എൻലൈറ്റനിങ് ടോക്ക് താങ്ക് യു വേദിയിലിരിക്കുന്ന എല്ലാവർക്കും എൻ്റെ നമസ്കാരം ഞാനും ഇവിടെ എൻ്റെ മാതൃഭാഷയിൽ തന്നെയാണ് എൻ്റെ നന്ദി രേഖപ്പെടുത്തുവാൻ ആഗ്രഹിക്കുന്നത് ഇങ്ങനെ ഒരു ക്ലാസ്സിൽ ഇവിടെ ഇങ്ങനെ ഒരു ക്ലാസ് നടക്കുന്നുണ്ടെന്നും ഇവിടെ വരാൻ വേണ്ടി എന്നെ വിളിച്ചു പറഞ്ഞതും ഇവിടെ ഈ സ്കൂളിൽ തന്നെ പഠിപ്പിക്കുന്ന എൻ്റെ അധ്യാപികയാണ് എന്നെ മുൻപ് പഠിപ്പിച്ചുകൊണ്ടിരുന്
ടീച്ചറോട് ഞാൻ ഒരുപാട് നന്ദി ഇപ്പോൾ രേഖപ്പെടുത്തുന്നു കാരണം എനി നിഷാ മിസ്സാണ് ഇവിടെ പഠിപ്പിക്കുന്ന ടീച്ചർ ഈ വർഷം ഇടയ്ക്ക് ഈ വർഷമാണ് ഇവിടെ വന്ന് ചേർന്നത് ഞാൻ മുമ്പ് പഠിച്ചിരുന്ന സ്കൂളിലാണ് എന്നെ പഠിപ്പിച്ചുകൊണ്ടിരുന്നത് നിഷാ ഷീൻ എന്നാണ് ടീച്ചറുടെ ഫുൾ നെയിം ഇപ്പോൾ എനിക്കും ഇതൊരു എൻ്റെ വ്യക്തിത്വം വികസിപ്പിച്ചെടുക്കുവാൻ വേണ്ടി നൽകിയ ഒരു ക്ലാസ്സായിട്ടാണ് എനിക്കും ഇത് അനുഭവപ്പെട്ടത് കാരണം ഇപ്പോൾ ആ സീറ്റിൽ നിന്ന് എന്നെ ഇവിടെ നിന്ന് ഇവിടെ ഒന്ന് എഴുന്നേറ്റ് വന്ന് എൻ്റെ നന്ദി വാക്ക് രേഖപ്പെടുത്തുവാൻ പറയ അങ്ങനെ ഒരു നന്ദി പറയുവാനുള്ള ഒരു ധൈര്യം എനിക്ക് പകർന്നു തന്നത് സാറിൻ്റെ ക്ലാസ്സാണ് അതിന് സാറിനോട് ഞാൻ ഒരുപാട് നന്ദി പറയുന്നു ഇപ്പൊ ഞാൻ പത്താം ക്ലാസ്സിലാണ് പഠിക്കുന്നത് പിന്നെ പത്താം ക്ലാസ് കഴിഞ്ഞിട്ട് എങ്ങനെ എനിക്കൊരു എനിക്ക് ഒരു ഐ എ എസ് ഓഫീസർ ആകാനാണ് ആഗ്രഹം എനിക്ക് അതിന് മുമ്പ് ഒരു ലോയർ ആകണമെന്നും ലോ എൽ എൽ ബി പാസ് ആയതിന് ശേഷം എനിക്ക് ഐ എ എസ് ഓഫീസർ ആകണമെന്നും എൻ്റെ ആഗ്രഹത്തിലുണ്ടായിരുന്നു പക്ഷെ ഇതിനെല്ലാം എങ്ങനെയാണ് ഒരു പടി പടിയായിട്ട് അതെങ്ങനെ എനിക്ക് പ്രാവർത്തികമാക്കണം എന്ന് ഇവിടെ ഈ സാറിൻ്റെ ക്ലാസ്സിൽ ഇരുന്നത് കൊണ്ട് എനിക്ക് മനസ്സിൽ ഒരു ഉറച്ച തീരുമാനം എനിക്ക് ഉണ്ടാക്കിയെടുക്കാൻ എനിക്ക് സാധിച്ചു അതിനും സാറിനോട് ഞാൻ ഒരുപാട് നന്ദി ഇവിടെ പറയുകയാണ് ഇത്രയും പറഞ്ഞുകൊണ്ട് എല്ലാവർക്കും നന്ദി രേഖപ്പെടുത്തിക്കൊണ്ടും സാറിനെ ഇവിടെ ഇവിടെ വ ഇവിടെ വന്നതിന് സാറിനോടും നന്ദി പറഞ്ഞുകൊണ്ട് ഞാൻ എൻ്റെ വാക്കുകൾ ഉപസംഹരിക്കുന്നു നന്ദി നമസ്കാരം ഞാൻ എൻ്റെ വാക്കുകൾ മലയാളത്തിൽ സംസാരിക്കുവാൻ ആഗ്രഹിക്കുന്നു വേദിയിലും സദസ്സിലും ഇരിക്കുന്ന മാന്യരെ ഞാൻ ഇന്ന് ഏറെ ചാരിതാർത്ഥ്യത്തോടെയാണ് ഇന്ന് ഈ വേദിയിൽ നിൽക്കുന്നത് എൻ്റെ എന്നെ ഇന്ന് ഈ വേദിയിൽ നിൽക്കാൻ അർഹനാക്കിയ എൻ്റെ പഴയ അധ്യാപകരും എൻ്റെ ഉഷാ മാഡത്തിൻ്റെയും മുൻപിൽ രണ്ട് വാക്ക് സംസാരിക്കുവാൻ ഞാൻ ഏറെ അഭിമാനത്തോടെയാണ് ഈ വേദിയിൽ നിൽക്കുന്നത് എന്താവണം എന്ത് എങ്ങനെ നമ്മുടെ ജീവിതത്തെ മുന്നോട്ട് നയിക്കണം എന്ന് നമ്മെ പഠിപ്പിച്ചതും അല്ലെങ്കിൽ നമുക്ക് നമ്മുടെ സംശയങ്ങളെ ദൂരീകരിക്കാൻ നമ്മെ പ്രാപ്തരാക്കിയ പ്രാപ്തയാ പ്രാപ്തയാക്കിയ നമ്മുടെ സാറിനെ ഏറെ അഭിമാനത്തോടെയും ഏറെ നന്ദി നന്ദിയുടെ പൂച്ചെണ്ടുകൾ അർപ്പിക്കുവാൻ ഞാൻ ഈ അവസരം അവസരം ഉപയോഗിക്കുന്നു നമ്മുടെ ജീവിതത്തിൻ്റെ പാന്ധാവിൽ നർന്നയെ ഒഴിച്ച് മുനിഞ്ഞു കത്തുന്ന ഒരു തങ്കപ്രഭ പോലെ സാറിൻ്റെ വാക്കുകൾ വെളിച്ചമേകാൻ കഴിഞ്ഞുവെന്ന് ഞാൻ ഉറച്ചു വിശ്വാസിക്കുന്നു വിശ്വസിക്കുന്നു അതുകൊണ്ട് ഏറെയൊന്നും ദീർഘിപ്പിക്കുന്നില്ല സാറിന് നന്ദിയുടെ പൂഞ്ചെണ്ടുകൾ വീണ്ടും അർപ്പിച്ചുകൊണ്ട് ഞാൻ എൻ്റെ വാക്കുകൾ നിർത്തുന്നു നന്ദി നമസ്കാരം നന്ദി anyhow it's raining heavily i would also request all of you to take a few more minutes to give us your feedback your contact number and address so that we can reach out to you when we organize more such program and i thank you for all my students and my ex students and all your speeches were quite touching and it really motivates me to organize more such program so it would be very good if you can give a few suggestions from your side and we are really looking forward for your feedbacks